Okay, hello dear friends. So uh, let's get started. I have a couple of brushes. I have a lot, but uh, the problem when you have too many things, it is hard to make a decision. So make yourself convenient and get a couple of brushes that you like. I like this two very much and uh, to get different texture put on piece of paper and uh, a kitchen towel so it can be used for this and also get your tabletop clean this is one side to prepare yourself and uh, another thing is about the color it does not it is not clean it's okay because we are artists right artists are not supposed to be too clean and drop a few drops of water so that it's not very 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 dry so you may use it but not uh, um, put too much water i used to put too much water and then the color all uh, float up and that is not good i'm so proud i finished one color and just about it and uh, this part you can use this part as uh, as uh, uh, as uh, um, as the, the the plate for mixing color and that is good enough already we may use a little bit and the color i use each time this is a green color because last painting I used a lot of green color and I have a big bucket and each time just a little bit of water so that we do not waste water, right? We want to be good people, right? And uh, get some testing paper handy. Uh oh, this one is dirty. So how about we use this as a testing paper? So we can get ahead and uh, you can see this one is long and slender. It's good for making these long and slender strokes and it can keep water. And this one is also long and slender but does not go as long as that one. But the good thing is because it's short, it is easier for you to control. You can maintain its uh, it's a shape and this one you need very good hand control and it's so easy to get wobbly and I make sure that my hand is not hurt because my hand will touch the paper so often you touch it one time it's not a problem but if you keep on touching oh sorry that must be very very loud if you keep on touching 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 it's better have a piece of paper so that uh, it's it's not hurting so i can just do this movement you can use tape you can use um uh, band -Aid if you have uh, a lot of money to buy band -Aid. so this one let me see what do we do first okay let me just get an idea on it very light that should be good ready set go oh a bit dirty that's okay we are artists about it now we will do the purple color use a little bit of purple that's kind of very very dry you can see it's it's hard like 
like a rock. So, and this is just perfect actually, but that is too much of this green color. And I do not need much green color. Clean up a little bit. Okay, and still there is green, but it's much less. Okay, maybe later on we add some purple. Oh, that is pretty, right? Let's do it. This is more or less like lavender. So some of it with more purple on it, some of uh, some with more uh, pink on it, violet, so that is more interesting, right? Okay, we will get some with more violet. Now we intentionally put put some purple on this side. red flower and now we will make this uh, shape more prominent so there are some of this better shape now we make another line of shape. How about some purple here? Purple here. This one. This one. This one. It's all a mess. It's okay for now. There is a lot of room we can later on take care of. Some purple. Okay, so after this, what we need to do, we will use this slender brush. Let me try. Now, this.
this one will penetrate into the flower bush. Yeah. So you can see this is one. Here, yeah, there is one. Okay. So intentionally. looks a little bit better and now we will do just some randomly some dark some we have lavenders at our home so we know it's absolutely a bush so your hand just very very smoothly do this movement and uh, now we will take care of uh, a little bit of these uh, flowers some of this red flower oh no I see orange different yeah. here and there and red is pretty put some red here and there so that's about it and now the bottom yeah Let's see now we put a bit dark oh i love it dark color oh that's good how about some purple here let's do it i will use this long and the slender for some purple bush dash come out come out come out come out oh i love it and some this some yellow some red orange let's see because hmm. okay i think i will stop here use another one bit more water You want to eccentricate. Am I using the right word? Sorry for my English. Eccentriate, eccentricate. Yeah, this world is. Uh, oh, oh, my hand. So that's about it. Shall we do some little grass? Doesn't hurt, right? Good. 
good not to make it too sudden okay so that's about it it's a, a new experiment and uh, sometimes when you stuck there and cannot move on search online get an idea and uh, start to practice it um, it uh, it will make you happy bye bye friends i love you i really do do 